ask you something. Am I uptight? Yes, you are uptight. Mama? Well, she is. Yeah. Oh, my God, you guys. Girl, just live a little. I mean, Alexis, you do need to find you a man, and then maybe we won't have to keep coming over here keeping you comfortable. Look, y'all, I'm not looking for no man. Dr. Roberts, I'm Devin Scott. Devin's that dope. Yeah, he looks so fine, girl. <laughs> God is going to let me know when he's sending this next man. Are you nervous? <laughs> no. Why would I be nervous? <laughs> Alexis! You know how Alexis is. She don't like to drink too much. She gonna lose control. Are you calling me a control freak? That's exactly what she calling you. What's going on? Can I take you somewhere before I take you home? Please? <sighs> it's beautiful. So why are you being so nice to me? Because I want to make you happy. You deserve it. You don't even know me. Happiness is knocking at your door. Please open it. Sweetheart, Alexis, I love you. I'm sorry. I can't. Devin, dear, go after her. I'm scared. It feels too good to be true. I really believe Devin loves you. We both do. Devin, I don't know how to love you. And I don't know how to accept that you love me. Can we just start over? Please. You know, the thing about love is it doesn't always come at a certain angle. It comes at you from many different directions. But when you know that you found a man that you can't live without, and you know it's love, then you hold on to him with everything you got. Don't you let that man go. He didn't